What a day for the men's quarterfinals here at the Pensacola Bay Center in Pensacola, Florida. Two fabulous games. We start with the number one seed out of the East, the Georgia State Panthers taking on Arkansas State. And the Red Wolves jumped out to a 32-19 lead in this ball game before the Panthers started their big comeback. Well, that freshman, Noor Chad O'Meara, most double-doubles of any freshman in the country, had a heck of a game as well. 16 points, 18 rebounds for him. And he was everywhere, especially on the glass. And Arkansas State looked great at that point, but then the Panthers closed the first half with a 15 to one run to take the lead. Justin Roberts really smooth with the jump shots from all over the place. And of course, Corey Allen, probably the leader of this basketball team with his aggressiveness and his ability to score inside and outside. That was a huge basket by him at the end. This is the final possession. Arkansas State needing a three to tie the miss by Farmington and then the miss at the buzzer and the Panthers are back in the semifinals as they are so accustomed to being here in this tournament then App State and the regular season champions Texas State and a fabulous finish to this one as Caleb Asbury hit two threes in the last 10 seconds this one in the buzzer to send us to overtime they were out of the basketball game till Asbury came back with back-to-back -back threes and we go to OT Almonte with the nice little move to lay it in past Isaiah Small and then Forrest has been doing this for so many years, just making big shots. He ended up with 28 to lead Appalachia. And that's his fifth 20 plus game in this last seven as Forrest is finishing his career at App State strong. So here is our Sunday semifinal men's bracket. Georgia State will take on Louisiana and then the two rival teams, Coastal Carolina meets App State. It all starts at 6.30 Eastern, 5.30 Central, right here on ESPN Plus with the championship game on Monday night on ESPN2.